I spend my mornings now trying to pound in the calories so that I have enough fuel in my system to walk the blocks, right? So I'm leaving in about 10 minutes to drive up to Glendale and um, do another eight hours. I haven't had a day off since um, a week ago Sunday. Now I've had some short days though. I've had some short days because I was recovering, my body was recovering from um, that horrible menstrual cycle, right? That really debilitated me. And I have follow-up doctor appointments over this too. I have to like go get more blood drawn. I have to like go back in for a primary care physician. And I think I have one of, oh yeah, they want me to do the women's visit too, I think. Makes sense, right? Because it was related to my menstrual cycle. So I'm, I'm pounding in the calories. And I, you know, I'm, I've shared out this Katie Porter video um, to like 78 groups or something. Shared it out to a ton of groups. And it never fails. There's always going to be some bitter progressives that just, or progressives, that um, just want a negative comment. I mean, they, they, their entire purpose is being negative and tearing down everybody or maybe specifically just me I don't know because I know there's been a lot of work done over the last few years to actually smear me um, so I got a couple this morning and I'm just like why why don't you just scroll <laughs> how can you not find the humor in that video you really have to find something to critique about it what's wrong with you guys I, I seriously don't even like um, if you live in such a world where you need to constantly like uh, troll groups for people's shares and put negative comments down on the shares, like for instance, one of the people was like uh, going after a Marianne Williamson video clip that I did, um, where I was comment. It was pure commentary, kind of like what I'm doing right now. It was pure commentary about how I've been getting whispers from various people in progressive politics that y'all want to run Marion Williamson. I was telling my take on that. And um, again, it's like, oh, I'm not allowed to have an opinion. Really? I'm not allowed to have every other live streamer on um, or YouTuber out there is allowed to have an opinion, but I'm not allowed to have an opinion. Get over your fucking selves. I, you know what? Most people are like, well, you shouldn't block anybody. You should just like let everybody have a place. No, I have never subscribed to that because I know that there are people out there with an agenda to try and smear me or other people and that they have messaging and a narrative that they're pushing. And I'm not going to fucking, I'm not going to give you my platform to do that. I won't do that. You show me that you have ill intent against me, you will be blocked. That is how I roll. And I have no problem saying it. Because I don't play these fucking games where I'm allowing negative people to boost my algorithms. That's not the kind of algorithm boost I want. And I've been quite successful in getting social media reach without that shit. I don't need that shit. Unlike my former project partner, I don't need to follow the follow backs just to build up my numbers. I want a quality audience, not a superficial bullshit audience. I want the people who actually want to have a discourse, want to have intelligent conversations. Those are the kind of people I would like to have conversations with. I, I do not have time for this nonsensical political bullshit where you're just like out there trying to tear down what you perceive to be the opposition. I have plenty of activist friends who spend all of their time doing exactly that, tearing down what they believe to be the opposition messaging. Look, you present yourself as a foe to me, you're getting blocked, period.